welcome to this channel i know your business may probably be in trouble now because your advertising access is restricted as you can see on the screen you are not allowed to use meta product to advertise this is because you didn't comply with one or more of our advertising policies affecting business assets or other standards such as having too many ads rejected attempting to circumvent our ad review process participating in a fraudulent behavior or associating with untrustworthy accounts. This is a disturbing news, especially if you are really advertising and you need more customers, your business is running smoothly and all of a sudden you are shut down like this. But I'm here to assure you that this account, your account will be reinstated. Normally, this happens because probably it is a mistake. Uh, the Facebook um, algorithm may suspect that you're, you are using a fake account or maybe you have two or three adverts that are rejected and all of a sudden it, it um, disables your account or um, maybe any other system error could cause you to be restricted and the last of them all is um, you may be you probably maybe you violated their policy so if you violate their policy of course your account will be restricted but most of the time, about 70 to 80 percent of the cases, it will not be a policy violation. So I am sure that if you didn't violate any policy, your account will be reinstated. Um, even if you violated a certain policy, um, to some extent, you could still be reinstated. It's in severe cases and in cases of repeated violations that you will be permanently restricted. So let us take a look at what and what we need to do in order to get back before we continue i encourage you to subscribe to this channel to turn on the notification bell we do powerful videos every day that will help you to really get the best from the uh, to, to to really to really be able to help your business to progress to help you uh, with digital activities that can help you to be able to do well online and to promote your business so um take time to follow it carefully even in the case where your account is permanently restricted we can still help you um, get an account or if your account is restricted like this and you don't want to request the review on your own you can contact us we'll help you uh, you can book our zoom service then we'll be on zoom to help you um, work things out and get everything perfectly check the link in the description to contact us if you may need to do that um, let's continue let's continue so now if your account is restricted like this these are some of the few things you need to do first of all um, you open your Facebook account you log into your Facebook account and then you go to the ad manager so how do you go to the ad manager you come to um, your left hand side here you will see um, ad manager when you click it brings you to the ad manager now inside the ad manager um, you will see something like what I'm seeing here. If it is a user account, there are many types of restrictions. If it is a paid restriction, it won't show here. If it is a business manager restriction, that doesn't uh, include an ad account. It You will not see it here. But if a user account or ad account is restricted, it will show here. So this one is a user account, and this is the highest form of restriction. For a user account, you cannot run an advert because... Um, once your user account is restricted means you as the individual or the user account of the account cannot do any other thing in relation to advert that is why you can't advertise if it were an ad account fully or a business manager or a page you can still advertise but for user account you can't do any advert so you will need to appeal so in re in appealing you need to click on the three lines here or you click on see details if whether you click on the three lines here from there you go to account quality or you click on see details it's going to send you to the same place so let me click on see details as you can see it is bringing us to account quality Now, on account quality, you can see, confirm your identity and request a review. So, if I, so before I do this, you have to make sure that you change your name to match with the ID card you are going to use to confirm your identity. So, make sure that you come to um, 
you, you come to back to the facebook main interface click on the three lines here you will see settings and privacy click on settings and privacy after you click on settings and privacy you will see settings below it you click the settings after that you go to um account and personal information you will see name and contact information so you go and change your name if your name doesn't match with what is on your id card and when i say name i mean your first and last name if you have a middle name on your id card that is not on facebook that may not be a problem though you can include it in order to be 100 uh, percent secure that your identity will be confirmed but if um your first and last name doesn't match that one you have to change it to match if you don't do that you have a problem okay so do that after that come back and click on the your name on the top left hand corner after that you can um, scroll down to about section click on the about section go down you see contact and basic info after you click on about and scroll down you see contact and basic info from there you go and change your birth date your birth date i mean the year the date and then um the month you were born make sure that it is matching with what is on your id card after that um, your gender too. If your gender does not match, make sure all those things are matching. When all that is done, come back to account quality and click on request review. Click on get started. And then you upload your ID card. And for your information, you can use um, a passport picture. You can also use a national ID card. You can use um, a voter ID. You can use a driving license. Any form of identification where your first and last name are there and your birth date is there with your profile picture and your gender, you can use it to verify. So these are the basic requirements they are looking for. Make sure all those that I mentioned are included in it. Then after that, you click on continue. As you can see, they say uh, it, it it is it says um, your identity information has been submitted. Continue to request the review. So we are continuing to request a review. So now they are asking, why are you requesting a review? Then the reason is, I have a reason that I want to state. So I'll click on another reason so that I can type exactly the reason that affects me. So I'm just getting the information to put it there. Okay, so they are asking me of the reason, and this is my reason. My reason is that I said the, I just wrote a letter uh, about a one-page document addressing it to dear Facebook or Meta. My user account has been restricted, and it has been a big blow to my business because the core of my business depends on Facebook as to sell. I am told this account doesn't comply with the advertising policies such as and I mentioned what they actually stated there and I went ahead to set up steady Facebook policies in detail and I know I did not really violate any of their policies and they should consider reinstating my account I re please I, 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 I plead with them to reinstate the account because I am extra sure this will be a mistake in any case even if it is not a mistake they should forgive me and reinstate the account for me that is what I wrote Please, many of you have asked me to send this text to you, but I encourage you, please, it won't be the best to do that. Almost everyone is using the same thing, and it is like uh, um, 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 something that they copy and they just paste, and it is not the best. At the end of the day, Facebook is able to detect that they are copying this information from someone, and they don't even consider whatever others write again. So, so it is done. Their account is in review and uh, when it's reinstated uh, after 48 hours um, I'll get a review a, a response from them and I'm sure this account will be reinstated as you can see here we are reviewing your, your Facebook account to determine whether it was correctly restricted from advertising we'll notify you within 48 hours from when you requested the review you can also track the status of your review in support inbox okay so you can wait after 48 hours come back to um account quality to check if it is reinstated you will see your advertising access is reinstated please i encourage you to subscribe to this channel most of you don't really you watch the videos about 99 percent of you but you don't subscribe i plead with you if this video has really 
um, help you, please subscribe to help me also grow. Yeah, I plead with you to do that so that I can produce more content that will help you to continue your digital marketing. Once again, thank you so much and have a great day.